Navigating the murky waters of Shark Tank deals entering the world of business often involves swimming with sharks. A lesson that entrepreneurs appearing on the hit show Shark Tank have learned the hard way. While the show offers promising opportunities for budding business owners to secure investments from seasoned investors, the aftermath of these deals isn't always smooth sailing. From renegotiated terms to failed partnerships, the reality of business can sometimes be starkly different from the TV spotlight. One example of a Shark Tank deal gone sour involves Al, Bubba, Baker and his family, founders of Bubba's Q Boneless Baby Back Ribs. After striking a deal with Damon John on air, the family alleged that John later renegotiated the terms off air, leaving them feeling deceived. Their allegations led to legal proceedings and a restraining order against them commenting on John publicly. This serves as a reminder that even deals made in the public eye can unravel behind the scenes. For Shelley Eller, the creator of Show No Towels, her experience on Shark Tank was marked by confusion and disappointment. Despite securing a deal with Lori Greiner on air, the agreement fell apart after the show. Eller recounts a lack of clarity regarding the terms and even received an uncashed check. Despite the setback, Eller's story highlights the complexities of post-show negotiations and the challenges entrepreneurs face in navigating business deals. Not all failed Shark Tank deals leave entrepreneurs in despair, however. Patrick and Jennifer Kadu, founders of Supply Razors, managed to turn their initial disappointment into a success story. Despite a deal with Robert Herjavec falling through, the couple leveraged their appearance on the show to boost sales and eventually sold their company for a profit. This demonstrates that while a partnership with a shark can provide a significant boost, entrepreneurs' success isn't solely dependent on these deals. Vladislav Smolyansky's experience with Kevin O'Leary showcases the importance of clear communication and follow-through. After securing a deal with O'Leary on air for his building block toy, Pin Block, Smolyansky found himself in a frustrating position. O'Leary's demands for the deal to hold were unmet, leading to a lost opportunity. The lack of direct communication between Smolyansky and O'Leary highlights the potential pitfalls of relying on intermediaries in business negotiations. The world of business is dynamic and often unpredictable a reality that Shark Tank entrepreneurs have come to know all too well. While the show provides a platform for aspiring business owners to pitch their ideas, it also exposes them to the complexities and challenges of real-world business dealings. These stories serve as cautionary tales and reminders that success in business requires not only a strong pitch but also the ability to navigate the murky waters that come after striking a deal with a shark. Thank you for watching our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and like for more news updates.